Is life after college working 40 hours a week really as bad as people say it is? Well, it depends on the job and what you fill your remaining time with. I was pretty miserable when I worked 40 hours at a job I hated and was in a relationship I wasn't satisfied with. Now I work 40 hours at a job I love. And I get to come home to wake up next to my best friend every day. Life is good. Not for many people. I'm well past college. I work 40 hours a week. And I'm pretty pleased with my life. Don't do something you hate just for the money. It's not worth it. Make a bit less doing something you enjoy or don't hate. And you'll be much better off mentally. I went to grad school after college which was like 70 hours a week plus classes and studying so by the time I got to a 40 hour a week job it was like being on vacation. Absolutely not. Most people do it and live happy lives. Obviously there's no shortage of people who are unhappy working 40 weeks. But for the most part life is what you make of it. My 40-hour work week barely even registers to me because I don't hate my job and focus on my home. Life rather than the place I go to support it. It really depends on what kind of job you get. I personally don't think it's that bad because life is a cycle of stuff. Like school isn't that different in that sense. I found it scary and soul-sucking at first the idea I'd have to spend 40 hours in an office and then at the time like 1.5 hours commuting each way. I'm a homebody. It did make me depressed but I pushed through it. Then it got very routine. Ultimately it was better than my college experience because I didn't have in the back of my mind anymore that I was sinking deeper into debt and wasn't sure if I'd even find a job. Eventually I worked a job with a shorter commute and less expectation to work off hours which improved my life. And then COVID I give huge credit for making remote working great and something I do more than half the week now which suits my homebody nature great. I never grew to be excited at the prospect of working but I see it as a necessary thing where what I dislike about it is more than made up for by what I like about it. Dollar 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 dollar. Plus when I get really sick of work I just take some vacation days. If you have a job you like, it's pretty good. If you really hate your job, then life can get pretty miserable. You basically wake up on Monday counting every minute until Friday. Then, on the weekend, you're constantly dreading about having to go back to work on Monday. Which kind of ruins the weekend. This cycle repeats again and again. If you like your job, then weekends probably aren't as valuable because you don't mind going to work and maybe even look forward to it. It's like the cliche, if you do what you love, you never work a day in your life. Or something like that. I don't agree with that saying because a dream job is still a job. But life is so much better when your job is something you actually enjoy and not something you're forced to do to pay the bills. It's not bad. You get paid for your time instead of paying to attend class. Personally I was relieved that the nights finally belonged to me. No papers to write. No textbooks to read. No class notes to memorize. Not if you enjoy the work. That's the key. Also setting time limits. Don't work 50 hours if you're only getting paid for 40. It's an adjustment that's for sure. My first job after college was at a call center and I was very depressed during that time. Not the only time I was depressed for over a year straight. But probably tied for worst with the year plus my back and shoulders hurt 24-7 from a herniated disc. But that's more of a don't get a bad job than don't get a job problem. Lot of bad jobs out there. But if you have a specific career goal in college with a useful degree that could help. Or just avoid call centers like the plague but the biggest big part of career growth once you're 
Foot is in the door are your soft skills, rather than job competency, so long as you're average. To get the life you want chose a job you like in a city you like and you'll be fine. A job doesn't define you. Let work be work and build your interests outside of work. Build a friend group outside of work. Always balance your life with work. I'll say this. Every day of my adult life has been better than any day I spent in school. I have absolutely loved working for a living and the opportunities in life it has provided. College was a necessity but was far from being the time of my life. Yes welcome to debt, exhaustion, and no life. Work was a means to retirement for me. I was lucky to work half my career with wonderful colleagues and supervisors. Don't be a victim be pro you. No, any change in patterns of life is a little tough. It definitely takes some getting used to what I found particularly difficult was the lack of breaks you get when you transition to full-time work. As a student, you get summer break, winter break, reading week, etc. Working full-time, you're just constantly working unless you choose to take time off. Definitely feels like a grind at times. If you are competent and the employer and employees are good people, it's great, unless it's too hard on your body. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epic Eracast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.